Hey y'all, I'm Parisian and this is Dream of Parisian Tarot. We're gonna get a few calls from my Aquariuses, okay? So please like this video if it resonates at all. Also, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And don't forget to check out my TikTok. The link is down below in the description box. And if you would like a personal reading, that information is also down below in the description box. So a few calls from my Aquariuses. So the first card I'm seeing, it says, you are their wish fulfillment. Okay, so somebody's wishing to be with you. And it says, you have healed him. Helping a depressed friend. So either you could be helping a depressed friend or your person is helping a depressed friend. But somebody calls illusions just to hold back the truth. So we know that illusions are lies. So somebody been lying so the truth won't come out. Someone could have a crazy, jealous boyfriend. And going to the beach. We have fire energy. So an Aries, Leo, or Sag could have something to do with this situation. And the seeds you planted are about to sprout, which is lovely. But it says, doesn't feel like you deserve the position you have. So somebody's mad about a position. Um. My opportunity, something that you got, another person feels like you don't deserve to have or they wish they had, okay? We have re relaxation. Someone could need some relaxation at this time. I'll put that right here. And we got a tricky situation going on. We also have earth energy. So a Capricorn Virgo Taurus could be involved in this situation. You have a lot of prosperity and success coming your way. And they wanted to bully you. So somebody was a big bully here. You could be beating yourself up, but don't do that. Give yourself lots of love. And it says discovering your talents. So someone could be discovering your talents, or maybe you're discovering new talents about yourself. Mom, this could be your mama, his mama, somebody mama could be involved. And it says, Tell me what tell me what you need and want. So somebody wants to know that. We got to pack your bag. Somebody could be moving or relocating or, or traveling. Because I was seeing energy of traveling. A Capricorn could be involved in this situation. Or you could just have it in your chart. But it says between the ages of 25 to 30, someone could be involved. You could reject me a million times and I still try. So somebody definitely wants that second chance with you. But we got abandonment issues that someone could be trying to heal from. It says things come so naturally to you. So you're natural at whatever you do, okay? And someone else could be trying to impersonate you in some type of way, especially because they feel like you don't deserve something that you have or get it. But it says he falling out with his friends. And that makes complete sense that this card is coming out. Because in the pre-shuffle, I was seeing a lot of cards about someone's homeboy. So maybe they was um maybe getting advice from their homeboys or just having a conversation with their homeboys about you okay because their homeboys want to talk to you or something like that or they're just very like freaking interested in y'all connection or something okay um we have nonchalant someone could be acting nonchalant like they don't care but they really do and something about a rocky relationship but she needs a favor and you can have a lot of confidence about yourself or you need to have more. Accounting and finances. Somebody could work in accounting and finances. Let me move this to the side real quick. And fuck other people's opinions, which means that other people have a lot of opinions on your connection. You're learning and you're growing, which is wonderful. And you need to surround yourself with people who want to see you win, which means that you didn't have people around you who wanted to see you win. Expensive gifts coming in. And who was going to take care of grandma or granddad? So somebody in the family could be sick or ill or needed some help at this time. And it says people are looking into your love life. A lot of people are not minding their business when it comes to your love life, okay? We have a daddy's girl. And trying to look into your medical record. So a nurse could be involved in the situation doing stuff they ain't got no business doing. And the streets are talking about this, which means everybody is talking about this. And that's probably why you got fuck up the people's opinions. You look very put together. This is good. 
and it says getting their life together this is also good marrying into royalty so someone could definitely be marrying into royalty or someone could be marrying another person who is very abundant and royal okay we have swinger someone could be and someone could be on the run we got fun night out somebody could want to have one with you and she claims she got an issue, but ain't said anything to you. So someone's talking major shit about you. Could be that bully that we were seeing. But they not saying this shit to your face. Living with dad and ghosted. You could be a very generous person. Or somebody's wanting to be generous towards you. But there is someone who is jealous of your shape soul food somebody could be cooking it but it also could be some type of family get together or party or event coming up they jealous of your spirituality so some of y'all are definitely spiritual witches tell me to suck something like that and i love you more than i show so somebody loves you a lot but they're not showing you making big purchases and your family is involved Someone could have had an abortion or there could be conversations about some type of abortion. Love your cooking and trying to be a good father. You need to defend your happiness. He ain't nothing but a dog. And old co-workers still watching you. You will be given a chance to redo something. They pissed that he loves you. And someone could be a party promoter. We got food critics. Someone could actually be a food critic or somebody could be criticizing someone's food or something like that. Because we did see love your food. So somebody cook some good food. It says intense ancestral initiation. So somebody's being initiated within their bloodline to maybe get um, break some generational curses or do something for their bloodline, period. And it says, you keep healing and living up. Ooh, a spiritual gateway is open, so definitely jump through it. And they're trying to steal your gifts. So you got some natural gifts. And that's why, you know, things come naturally to you because it's, it's God-given gifts, you know. And you got opportunities heading your way. And somebody wants to steal your opportunities from you, but they can't steal what's destined for you. From, for you. Raised war on an earth angel. So somebody's an earth angel, a good person, and somebody was trying to go up against the earth angel, which is not smart. We also have anniversary. So an anniversary could be coming up or something. And someone could be a bus driver. Or remembering old memories. So somebody been thinking about the past of that. You need to book the trip. And someone could be sensitive as fuck at this time. They've been fantasizing about you. And someone is envious of your job or career. We have expensive jewelry. You do got that card talking about expensive gifts coming in too. And it says a secret admirer is coming to assist you. So somebody wants to come in and help. A Leo could have something to do with this situation. And it says your ancestors are all around you. Keep your friends out your business, which means some of y'all got some messy-ass friends or they doing something to sabotage you in some type of way. But it might not be your friends. It could be his friends. Because like I said, homeboys and um, damn, bro, why did you let her go? All types of shit like that was coming out. So it's like they homeboys been watching you and they want you. Ooh, my, my hand. We got better eating habits, which is good. And you need to expand your content strategy. So some of y'all could definitely be content creators, influencers, something like that. And you could be expanding or trying to figure out ways to expand. Also, someone's definitely trying to figure out how to make, um, looking for ways to make more money in some type of way as well. Also, no, if this is not happening directly to you, it could be happening to your person or somebody around you. So put it whatever it fits, okay? I could be saying he, when really it could be a she. So flip it and reverse it. I need you. All right, as soon as I open up the deck, we'll be seeing for my um, Aquarius. Oh, shit. What is that? 
right. smoke and mirrors which means things could be hidden at this time someone may have been trying to create some type of illusions or keep someone because you did have caused illusions to hold back the truth so someone's being able to see through it or having some type of epiphany because we got a burst of magic so you are magical you are tapped in and it looks like somebody could have been trying to tell some type of stories or lies because they had some type of merry motive you get what i'm saying and somebody was having a hard time trying to decide about something or decide who was telling the truth or something like that but it looks like you're about to be able to see through some type of smoke and mirrors you get what i'm saying so you're being able to see through the lies and you could be about to have some type of epiphany about something or you recently just had one but this is good oh, like something gonna click to you out the blue or something gonna happen where you gonna see even more clearly or something or maybe you might have a conversation with a per yeah some of y'all might be about to have a conversation or something like that and something gonna click to you Ooh, roots of abundance so whatever abundance that's coming to you is rooted in you you're supposed to have it it's yours whether somebody feels like you don't deserve it or not that shit is yours your ancestors may be trying to give you something or give you the key to do something um especially with intense ancestral initiation coming out but this was rooted in you okay and imperfect everything is coming in perfect harmony also someone could be listening to a lot of music and stuff like that but you got new doorways and opportunities to open up for you we got 11 here um you know 11 add up to two too so you got two right there too so things coming into balance after some type of truth is coming out so the, the more the truth is coming out the more balance is coming to be at the bottom of the deck, yeah, and it's healing your heart in some type of way. It could also be healing your your lover's heart, too, because somebody was hurt real bad. What's under there? Into me, I see. So somebody could definitely be looking deeper into you, all right, or, like, loving what they see in you, okay? As soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Aquarius is two of wands. Ooh, somebody manifesting you. But also, you could be trying to make a decision at this time. What's under there? Yeah, because somebody felt rejected or they like unhappy with how everything is going at this time, right? But it's a whole opportunity coming, but you got to make sure you don't miss it. Look up, don't miss the opportunity. Seven of one, see somebody was coming up with a game plan or trying to defend themselves in some type of way. The world, because somebody was leveling up and glowing and shit, but you're being watched the whole time in some type of way too. Also, someone could be about to travel or graduate or something like that as well. But we got the chariot, which is about victory and success. But somebody could be traveling somewhere or wanting to travel with you. And we got justice here on the strength card. Somebody could be having court issues or legal fees that they worried about, too. And somebody could have had court issues or something. Somebody could have been played um, over, like, a car situation or something. Cards. Let me see. Yeah, somebody heartbroken. As you can see, this person is praying. So this could have been a, definitely a third-party situation. Somebody could be moving or relocating page of cups but it's like this person been fantasizing about you a lot and wanting to be with you and wanting to apologize to you because maybe they hurt you maybe they got you crying but somebody been crying a lot and they feeling stuck and confused and helpless and hopeless and you see this car sticking out right here right crying thinking about the past remembering old memories unhappy with how things are at this time and wanting to fix it the stars uh, someone could definitely be taking the kids out maybe to like the beach or something like that but this person you are this person's wish fulfillment maybe they want to travel with you or something not as soon as but they're having a hard time trying to figure out exactly what to say to you but they want to come rushing in towards you though and we got the king of swords um this could be your energy or you could be dealing with another air sign but this person is trying to they could have been getting advice from other people or something to try to figure out what to say even if they are distant and cold they are still thinking about you king of cups because underneath it all they're very emotional and sensitive over you but they could have stabbed you in the back and betrayed you but you're going through a rebirth at this time 
Alright. Y'all give me one second. As soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Aquarius is I can't stop thinking about you. So they think about you all the time, alright? And we got us against the world. So us against the world comes out when everybody is trying to break y'all up or a lot of people are trying to cause issues or blockages within y'all connection because they want your spot. Alright? Let's see. Please have a few cards from my Aquarius. We got high ranking witch. So some of y'all could definitely be terrified the psychics, witches, okay? Of some sort or somebody's going to one. But it say like, please talk to me. So somebody wants to talk to you about something. They want to communicate, right? And they say, I know I fucked up my chances with you. So they could definitely hurt you in some type of way or stab you in the back. And now there could be some type of distance or some type of silent treatment or something like that. They also could be worried that because a lot of people are attracted to you. All right. So you could definitely be very beautiful or handsome or something. And a lot of people could want you. And they don't want nobody else to have you. Cars. Come on. Yeah. But it say they are going to make it hard for us to be, good, be together. So a lot of people are trying to break y'all up or keep y'all apart or something. But it says I want to take you on a date. So they definitely want to spend that one on one time or fun have a fun night out with you or something like that. Uh, somebody painted you out to be a bad person. They spread some type of false rumors. But it says I want to wake up to you next to me. I'm obsessed with the way you shine. I will do anything for another chance. You keep winning, they can't beat you. They, they trying to get back into your good grace. And I put you above everyone. Now you're supposed to be with me. So y'all might not be together. Might not be talking as much or something like that. But they feel like you're supposed to be with them. At the bottom, I hope you will wait for me. So there's definitely some type of weighing energy. But y'all do see this card sticking out in the back right here. Somebody was playing both sides, whether it was him or another person that was like in the middle of y'all's connection or something. But somebody was playing both sides. All right. Let's see what we got over him. As soon as I open the deck, we'll be seeing. I just dream and wish for everything. So this person has definitely been fantasizing about you a lot and dreaming about you a lot. So definitely pay attention to your dreams because they could be popping up in your dreams or you could be popping up in theirs or both of y'all could be popping up in each other's. I feel the same way. So however you're feeling, your person is feeling too, y'all could be mirroring each other at this time. Thinking and feeling the same thing words do hurt so maybe something that you said hurt them or something that they said hurt you but it says love is the answer so somebody's trying to figure out answers on how to fix this situation but you just gotta love you <laughs> all right just show love basically do you even care so somebody's wondering if they person even still care about them especially since there's some type of uh, separation or silence between you two so it needs to be some clarification and they could be seeking professional advice all right or someone needs to seek professional advice instead of their homeboys because their homeboys are sniffing up your ass okay they want you It says, think before you act. So that's what they're doing, trying to figure out exactly what to say. And they are waiting for you. Notice how all of these cards are blue. Um, this person is a bit emotional and sensitive over you at this time. You could also be as well. I'm afraid to talk to you. All right? But it's not that they don't want to. I'm just a little afraid. At the bottom of the deck, I never imagined so much perfection. Okay? <clears throat> as soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my queries is ease. I don't want to make the same mistakes I did in the past. <clears throat> so they could have messed up with you. They could have hurt you. And they don't want to do it again. They are mad because you're not helping them. So um, somebody could definitely either want your time, attention. They could want your money. They could want your sex. But maybe you're not giving something to them or something. And they could be getting a bit upset. But um, there's somebody who's trying to compete and beat you, especially if you are a tarot reader. So we did see uh, a high-ranking witch. So if you are a witch, a reader, someone is trying to compete and beat you over your level. Also, some type of success that you're getting. And it says, I'm not your ex. I won't hurt you. 
Now, somebody could also be going to a tarot reader to try to figure out how to compete and beat you, okay? Y'all put it where it fits for you. They see you as a three. It says, I wish we were free to be together, which means that somebody could definitely still be in a relationship or obligated to another person, but they do want to be with you. They're just not free. And somebody been doing a hell of a lot of shadow work, thinking about everything and trying to heal it. Avoiding certain topics because it's fights going on. You're catching the attention of so many people around you. It is causing arguments and fights. So somebody's getting a lot of attention. Let's see. Yeah, they've been competing with your looks and beefing over money. So somebody could be mad at you about your money as well. Yeah, because people can see your spiritual talent. So some of y'all are definitely spiritual. But remember, at the beginning, they said jealous of your spirituality. And people are discovering your talents and shit. They wish they had what you two have. So you got a connection with another person. And there are people who are hating and wishing they had the connection that you have with that person, okay? At the bottom of the deck, something about a new house, new home. Somebody could be buying one, relocating, moving, or wanting to, okay? Um, let's see. Let's get some of these. As soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my classes is, it says your music, poems, or words is about to go viral. So somebody could make poems or um, make music, whatever you do or create is about to go viral, okay? And it says thoughts and memories of you keep them up at night. So somebody is thinking about you a hell of a lot, all right? I'm also seeing her and all her friends are watching you. So there's a female and all her friends that are watching you. Could be some type of mess or something going on. All right. Somebody's a hateful, jealous person. So it says, people want to listen to your judgment because you have a good moral compass. All right, so you could definitely be a good person and you give excellent advice in some type of way. You got morals. A lot of people don't have that. This can be fixed, but only if you come and tell me the truth. So somebody wasn't telling the truth. They was lying. But they have an opening where all they got to do is tell the truth and then it can, they can fix it. Fake page is watching you someone's plans are going to fail because you can hear their thoughts because somebody's very intuitive psychic or a tarot reader a friend is lying so we were seeing that earlier somebody was lying they had some type of motive against you the karmic is watching your channel and taking notes so some of you could have an own channel or this could be some type of social media platform that you have but they're watching you taking notes so that makes sense why we're seeing the karmic um and her friends. No, she is watching you and all her friends watching you too. Some shit like that that we just seen a couple seconds ago, okay? Somebody could be in a trap house or they could be in the streets doing stuff they ain't got no business doing. And it says they always single me out and treat them better than me. So it's like somebody's in competition or feel like somebody's getting more or getting more attention. Something like that. They don't know what to say but they can start by telling the truth because somebody been lying the whole time. And he says nice things about you when she gets mad. So there's some type of female who is mad at you because of how your person feel about you and mad about your connection. Again, your music poem of words is about to go viral. Cards. And it says, uh, they got mad because you took your energy away. So again, Maybe you detach or something like that. They miss your energy. But there's also another person that you might have detached from too. Because they was on some, some weird shit. But it says, he has fear in the back of his mind that she is going to tell you what he did. So y'all know somebody mutually. Whoever this mutual friend is, then sabotage you or then spread some type of rumors or lies in their ear. I want us to live together and create loving memories. So this person definitely wants to live with you. Because we did say new house, new home, stuff like that. Um, and they want to be in your energy. And it says, I'm addicted to your body. So please like this video if it resonates at all. Thank y'all so much. I love y'all.